All right, so for Estrema, uh, positioning hands on the Estrema, you want to give yourself about two to three inches of space towards the end, Iran. The reason for that is because with some of our defenses and such, you actually use this tail end as a hook. So like in some of our Estrema defenses, we hook around to the side there from my forearm or wrist, digs into one side of the neck, the Estrema sticks, in, sticks into the other side, and I create this hook sort of containment on them. But again, uh, and if you hold it away at the tail end, yeah, you don't have as good of a grip. So, uh, use about two to three inches of space, okay? For a screen of counts, essentially what we're looking at is how many techniques did you do before you get back to the, to the restarted position, okay? So for example, um, like, like two count, you know, two count could be one, two, back, for example. So two hits before I got back to my original position. Two count could also be one, two, back. One, two, back. Or two count could be one, two, back. One, two, back, right? So again, regardless of how many six you got, the number of hits that occur before you're back in a reset position, starting the combination over again. So starting with two count, this, these are the three that you get. These three counts are the specific combos that we test you on. Starting the extreme ones, uh, one on each side. And all of these are gonna be aimed towards like the head for right now. Uh, we'll do some lower body shots later. So I want you to pretend like you're aiming kind of at the side of the head right here. So boom, strike one, back, boom, strike two, back, good? And again, it's, it's all wrist motion. The arm just helps it get extended out so it's close enough for the extreme to hit the target but the power comes from the wrist, okay? My arm doing the work is actually a lot slower, and with the sticks, you want the wrist motion in charge of that, okay? So, doing this two count, body, just like we twist, punch, twist, boom, strike, back, twist, boom, strike, back. One, two, back. One, two, back. One, two, back. Now going to four count. Go to the first one that we just did, so high. And then we're gonna flip the wrist. So it's not my arm making this big C motion. I strike, flip the wrist, strike low. So you could imagine that I might be striking someone to the head, and if we're going really low, maybe I'm striking down to like the, the shin or the knee or the, the outer part of the, the leg, thigh, boom, boom, boom. Could also be head, Rib shot, depending on where they're open. So, high, flip, low, back. Now with the left hand, high, flip, low, back. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Boom, boom. And pause. Good. Last one is six count. This one, right hand starts high, left hand starts in your right armpit. The right hand hits high, like we've done three times so far, across to the left side. Your left side hits medium across to the outer part of the arm. The right hand, which is now up high, hits high again and goes underneath. And then the left arm bumps up to take the high place. Left hand hits high, across, Right hand, medium to the side, high with the left hand, bumping down below. High across, medium to the side, high down. High across, medium across, high down. One, two, three, four, five, six. 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 Good. All right, pause for a second, Mr. John, if you can come and stand over here. So again, restarting the counts, I'm just having um, a visual, kind of like with our short stuff, bunk guy. So uh, two count, 